My name is Alicia. I work in a state facility. Hi, my name is Kim and I work in one of the state-operated IRAs. Hi, my name is Melissa. I work at a state-operated IRA. It was just a regular day. We come, you know, regular routine in the house. Uh, everything was normal, nothing unusual. Uh, we sit down about approximately about 7.30 a.m. Uh, we did the report and um, we looked and there was a smoke coming out from the registers this huge amount of black, thick smoke. Everybody just instant reaction. Um, I just yelled fire and um, everybody just jumped. We, had, uh, we have 12 individuals in the house and seven was on the fro uh, front room, program room, when we were doing the report. Uh, four individuals in the back, in bed. We then sounded the alarm and started evacuating people from the house. As we went through, we made sure to close all the doors behind us to confine the fire. Everyone worked so together through many years of training and uh, doing actual evacuation. I think that helped everyone doing the right thing. And um, the fire alarm come out, the doors are closed. And I did, in my head as we were going out, I remembered talking to uh, m another staff, John, to pull the alarms. We then brought individuals out as we went along. We took blankets with us because it was very cold out that day. I was the last one out with an individual grabbing the oxygen running out and I, when I look back our program area is really a large room and in just a few seconds the whole room was just filled with dark great smoke and it was probably about four feet from the floors that you could actually see the light. We had got the, the individuals in the front of the house out. We had put blankets on them, we took them to the rear of the house over in the parking lot which is the meeting place. And then myself and Julie attempted to go back in after we got outside because we knew there were four more individuals in the back that were still in bed. We tried twice to get through the back door. We couldn't. We were coughing and gagging. And in the meantime, one of the other girls was coming out with everybody except one. The one we were trying to get, the individual that was in bed, which her door had been shut just to defend in place. Um, Nicole went back in. She got down on her knees and crawled and got to the room and got the individual out. And we're all were in the parking lot. It was just such a relief and exhausting and um, and actually we were proud that we did get everybody out. So we lived across another IRA which we did call over there if they could come and help them if you, you know to because uh, it was a very cold day and just looking across from the road and seeing the response from another IRA to come and give us the help with our individuals to it was a very um, relief